morning everyone. So I am trying something a little bit different this week. I'm going to try to do a week in the DCP vlog kind of thing. This is something that my roommate suggested me do last year and then I never got around to it. So I definitely wanted to try and do it this week, um, this year at least. And then I thought this week would be a good one to do because I've got some good stuff on. There are some days like where it's not going to be that busy but I figured that's that's what it's supposed to be. Like it's not supposed to be action packed every day like it is a job at the end of the day at DCP like it's not just a holiday so today is Wednesday I think the 27th of June might be 26th um and I have work from 12 till 6 today so a pretty easy short shift and then afterwards I'm going to Hollywood Studios because tomorrow we get blocked out of the studios until Toy Story opens so I want to make the most of one last evening there um but obviously I I work till 12 so I have the morning to do some errands so I'm going to Publix to do my shop and then I'll get the bus to work do that and then studios so yeah Publix it is for groceries because you do have to eat some meals in your apartment sometimes we can't just live on like Mickey waffles <laughs> in my apartment now obviously this is not my usual get up um, I'm about to leave for work in about 20 minutes to get the bus to go to Disney Springs um because I work at World Disney by the way so what normally happens Publix is like a 15 minute walk from Patterson so I normally walk there and then there's like a, a leisure bus the eight route I think it is and I normally get that back because it takes about like 30 40 minutes to get there and the same amount like 30 minutes back um, which is just ridiculous like when it's so close so normally what I do is I walk there and then I time it so that I get the bus back but today it was gonna be like another 30 minutes until the bus came so stupidly I was like I'm not gonna wait I'm gonna walk with all my groceries so I was such a mess when I got back so just been taking some chill time I was gonna do like a grocery haul and then I realized that literally no one cares that I bought pasta and oatmeal again so there is that, but yeah, um, about to go to work, so I guess I will see you after. Hello, it is. <laughs> Hello. I'm on my Disney mode after like a six hour shift. Right, I am done with work. It is 20 past six and I'm waiting for an Uber or a Lyft or whatever to take me to Hollywood Studios for an evening there. So yeah, oh, exciting. I earned my ears today. So we've got a little certificate. I'll probably put like a photo in um, and all like we had a leader and some people come around and clap, which was very cute. So yeah, I'm officially a merchandise cast member. Let's go celebrate with food because I am so hungry. I am back with my favourite snack, dinner time. I'm so hungry and so ready to eat this. Just as good as I remember. Time for the cheese. One thing I love about getting this is the cheese flavoured cheese sauce so we're not actually having authentic it's not focusing but we're not having authentic cheese sauce it's just cheese flavoured makes me feel even better about my choice to be fair Kira's having a trifle for dinner <laughs> so Maybe winning all you want to yeah winning all round <laughs> but with waters for hydration <laughs> So we have come 
to the Christmas store that I used to work in and here is the five minute Christmas stories book that I possibly read on my shifts. Oh, that's really funny. I'm not saying it wasn't busy in here at all, that's but I possibly read the whole thing in like one shift and then kept rereading it. Cool. So, a fun fact I learned in training, this is the only place in the world where Audrey Hepburn has her handprints because she was called out by Disney to do it and she did it and when she was got the call apparently she cried and they were like why are you crying and she said because no one's ever asked me to do it before like the Hollywood actual Walk of Fame had never asked her so when this came out the Hollywood Walk of Fame of course was like oh my god we're so sorry how did we miss this like of course we'll invite you to do it and she was like mm -mm, you didn't ask me they're only going to be in Disney so this is the only place that you can find them before your dinner technically. I did. Also, I don't know what that's supposed to be but it's terrifying and to not be anywhere near children. <laughs> that's just not okay. Be guy taste test coming up. Oh, I missed that one up. <laughs> dun, dun. Dun, dun. So it's really thick. Creepy. It's quite nice though. Yeah. <laughs> end to the day to week to day one of the weekly vlog Transdar just broke down right outside Chatham so luckily we're not at Vista because I don't know when those guys are getting home but it literally just stopped in the middle of the street <laughs> <laughs> and we are walking home so people wanted to see what it's really like a week of the DCP this is it we are loving life woo <laughs> thought the vlog was over but I guess it's not. We were just walking back into housing and this guy stopped me and was like, oh, I watch your videos. And I was like, okay, sure you never expect people to actually watch them. Um, and then he was like, yeah, so the other day walking to a meeting, but you were busy, so you didn't want to say hi. And they said he watched my merchandise video like six times to check you wanted that role. So that was really awesome. And like, he had like a Brazilian accent or something. So international people as well. So. That just made my night and I am now off to shower and sleep because it's about 10.30 and it's been a long day so I will see you for the next one tomorrow.